Welcome to the channel guys. If you're watching this video, you're having some issues with your AC unit on your Toyota Tacoma. Mine was only working on high and then it actually stopped working altogether. And after doing some research, I found a quick and easy fix. The part that went bad on my Toyota Tacoma was the blower motor resistor. And that is why it would work on high still, but not on any of the lower modes because it didn't have the resistor working. And then mine eventually stopped working altogether. I went ahead and bought the package that also had the connector piece. It's going to depend case by case if you actually have to replace the connector piece. But when I looked at mine, I noticed it did have a burn mark. So I was going to go ahead and play it safe. And in that bag, it comes with quite a bit of wiring. Of course, you're going to have to get some wire strippers to strip the ends. And then you'll put one end here and the other side in there that if I stripped wire. And you would clamp that down to have the connection. Jumping straight into the installation, this is on the passenger side underneath the glove department. And you can see this clip here. You're going to pull that towards you and then pull that out. And you can see there's the burn mark that I mentioned before. You can see here there's only two hex screws or hex bolts holding those in. And that's going to be a 732nd head. And you're going to put that on and go ahead and loosen both of those. Once you get that completely loosened up, that piece is going to actually just pop straight out. Now be careful when you're loosening the back screw. There's a chance that if it just falls out, it could go behind the carpet and that's going to be really hard to get back. Once we got it pulled out, it looked pretty old. You could see on the back here, it said it was made in Japan. So I'm wondering if this was the original part or if this was just a replacement part. You could see some corrosion there that was clearly doing some damage. And then comparing that to the new one, you can see there's quite a difference. So if you reverse engineer that, you're just going to pop that back into place and then put back both of those screws. And to put on the connector, the first thing you're going to have to do is cut off the old connector. You can see close up that there was a little bit of a burn mark where that went out. And on the connector that they gave us in the bag, you have to strip off all of the ends. There's going to be four different ends that you're just going to strip off. We have wire strippers here. Of course, you could do that with a knife if you don't have those. Once you strip both sides of the wire, you could go ahead and put on the connector and clamp that down. Of course, whenever we tried, it didn't work well. So we went ahead and used these wire nuts. You just put those both together and sort of thread it in to make the connection. Now, I know a lot of you are going to say that looks pretty ugly. We're going to hide that underneath the dash so no one's going to see that anyways. When you're connecting those wires, make sure they're in the same order that you cut them. And that clip is going to be facing you when you plug it back in. You can see when I plugged it back in here, it started right up. My AC wasn't working at all. And now it's working on one, two, and three. For some reason, it's not working on four. I think that has something to do with a update I need to do on the screen that I have in my car. I don't think that has to do with the parts that I just bought. It is ironic though, because most people complain about it only working on four. And now mine's only working on one, two, and three. So it is the exact opposite. All said and done, this was a quick and easy fix. Only cost about $20 to $40 depending on where you get the part. Probably a little cheaper if you ordered online. If you liked the video, drop a like and share with someone who's having a similar problem. Thank you for watching this video and be sure to subscribe for more.